you got this one first. Basketball in the Hawkeye State, which is Iowa, is loaded this season. But I want to know, do you think it is a Hawkeye State or a Cyclone State? It's a Hawkeye State until the Cyclones win, and TJ's done a great job there. I mean, he, he's a perfect example of how you can flip a program in one year, given how the transfer portal operates now. You get all these, these guys. You have your, t- your five top scores are four transfers and a freshman that's going to be the Big 12 freshman of the year in Tyrese Hunter. Let's just go ahead and say it. I called it before the season. He's been terrific. Go <laughs> ahead. Pat me on the back. I'm going to take that one right away. But Plus one. Plus one. <clears throat> give it to me. Uh, Isaiah Brockington's been terrific. Cal, sure, even though he hasn't been super efficient, he's still been good enough. Uh, any series, it's called the Iowa Corn Cyhawk series, fires me all the way up. And – I was reeling a little bit. You lose to Purdue, you lose to Illinois back to back, and then you go to your in-state rival. That's going to be interesting. I wanted to kind of make a joke about like Otzelberger being the worst thing for Iowa since the bowl weevil, but I decided against it. I'm not making that joke. I'm not making that joke because we're going a long way back in history, and I don't want to offend anybody from the flat state. That's the but, thing I think you've ever said. I know. You know what the bowl weevil was? Great Depression took out all the crops. Iowa – had it had it rough for a while so there you go um, <laughs> but I, but I like I like I was I like Iowa State I think man he's got them playing hard they defend and Isaiah Brockington man he's come over some kind of career re-emergence program there in uh what is it Ames no it's not Ames I, I get him confused somewhere it, over there. it is Ames it my bad I, I'm going crazy right now but Ames you can see you can see Iowa's campus because it's so flat you can see it from Ames you can so see funny. Both campuses right there because it's so flat. But uh, if the Cyclones win, give them the state. Give them the state. <laughs> yeah, they play Thursday night. Um, that'll be a fun matchup, one that uh, I, I can guarantee is going to be a loud building. Fancy, where do you stand? Well, I think that Isaiah Brockington is, is a star. And I think that this team, I'll tell you, when I watch them on Saturday night at Creighton, tough place to play. They kind of give me Virginia vibes, like like Virginia good teams vibes. Um, not pretty at all. It's not pretty. Like, they won very ugly the other night. Very ugly. Um, but you know what? They just play – you said it, T.O. They play so hard. They get up in you. They, they do a good job of making you uncomfortable. I think they defend ball screens extremely well, and that's where I think Iowa's going to have problems. Iowa's going to have problems because Iowa State comes up. They cut off that ball screen with hard hedge, and they they make you work for what you're going to get. Creighton, who's not offensively solid, uh, they're, they're a work in progress themselves, very young team. But I thought that Iowa State, Nick Ba was on the telecast, our friend Nick Ba, and he said, Iowa State's defense is keeping Creighton from running their stuff. Guys, we're talking about Greg McDermott. Like, you, you just kept Greg McDermott from running his stuff. Like, that's a that's – a, Really gutsy, a gutsy road win. Um, so for Iowa State, Brockington's a star. I, I thought that on when I watched them on Saturday, the fact that they had Caleb Grill come off the bench, he has a, a career night for them. Again, not a pretty team. They can shoot the three. They don't take a ton of threes, but they can shoot the three. They went seven for 14, and that went over Creighton. I like Iowa State because I like them defensively more than I like Iowa, and so that's why I've got the Cyclones on Thursday night. Yeah, the thing that's great about Iowa State is um, this is not a typical Iowa State team. They are going to win the fight before they win the game. Yep. I, I like that about them. Last thing I'll, I'll note is they have two really, really good guards in Brockington and Tyrese Hunter, two guys that can go out and win a game for you. So if you can defend and you have two guys that can take a game over, that makes you a dangerous basketball team.